Hello there, good morning. Welcome to Cradle Roll Sabbath School. I hope that you are well and thank you for joining us today on our online programme. Now it's time to start our Sabbath School. What time do we come to Sabbath School? We come quite early on a Saturday morning, don't we? Well, I've got my lovely little clock here. I wonder if you can see what time it is. Well, we start our Sabbath school at quarter to ten. And I love that my clock here makes a nice tick tock, tick tock, tick tock. Isn't that fun? My nice ticking clock. So, you may not have a ticking clock at home like me, but I think you should go find a clock at home. Maybe a watch. Maybe you could use a phone. Something that tells the time. And you can use this and you can make it tick like this. And we'll sing our TikTok song. Have you found something? Good. Now let's make our clocks tick and sing our TikTok song. Ready? This is what the clock says. Tick tock, tick tock. This is what the clock says. Tick nicely. Is this time still quarter to ten? I think it is. Shall we sing it again? Can you make your clocks tick? Are you ready? This is what the clock says. Tick tock, tick tock. This is what the clock says. Tick tock, tick tock. This is what the clock says. Tick tock. It's lovely to see all your ticking clocks and thank you for coming to Sabbath School on Time. Can you think of something that God has made? God made so many wonderful things. He made us. He made the animals. He made the world. So many wonderful things. But there's something really beautiful that you can see in the sky sometimes. You can see it when it's raining and sunny at the same time. Can you think what I'm talking about? Is it something very colourful? Very pretty? In fact, I think it's a beautiful rainbow. <gasps> can you see my gorgeous rainbow with all the lovely pretty colours? They're very pretty, aren't they? Now I'm sure at home you've got something very colourful like this. I have my own rainbows that we made for Cradle Roll. I'm going to wave these around and we're going to sing Who Made the Beautiful Rainbow. So go and find something colourful and let's sing our song together. Are you ready? Have you got something colourful? Then let's sing. Who made the wonderful so many pretty colors now I think it would be a good idea that we all stand up and we can walk around the room with our pretty colors let's sing again who made the just like the rainbow God made. Well done, I'm finding something so colourful. Now we have many things that make up our body. We have feet, we have hands, we have a head, we have shoulders, lots of things that make up our body. But can you make any of those things make a noise? Try and think. How can we make a noise with the things that God gave us on our bodies? 
what if you take your hands and you clap? Oh, good job. Can you clap really loudly for me? Wow. Good job. Because I have hands that clap, clap, clap. Because they were made by Jesus. Let's sing I have hands that clap, clap, clap. And I want to hear you clap really loudly. Ready? I have hands that clap, clap, clap. I have hands that clap, clap, clap. I have hands that clap, clap, clap. They were made by Jesus. Good job. Now, what are these things at the end of our hands that I'm wiggling right now? Are they fingers? Can you make your fingers wiggle, wiggle, wiggle like this as well? And how about you go around and you tickle your mummies and daddies and your brothers and sisters? Because we're going to sing, I have fingers that wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Ready? I have fingers that wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. I have fingers that wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. I have fingers that wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. They were made by Jesus. Well done, everyone. Now, I need you to stand up and I want you to be really, really tall. Can you be really, really tall for me? When you're really, really tall, do you stand on your feet or, in fact, do you go on your toes? <gasps> you do go on your toes, don't you? And when we're on our toes, we can be really quiet. Shh. So let's see if you can walk on your tippy, tippy toes quietly around the room. Ready? I have feet that tippy tippy toe. I have feet that tippy tippy toe. I have feet that tippy tippy toe. They were made by Jesus. Good job, everyone. Now, I think it's time that maybe we talk to Jesus. So we can talk to Jesus in many ways. But Jesus likes when we come and kneel down for him. So let's sing the end of our song as we're going to pray. I have knees that bend by my chair. I have hands that fold in prayer. I have eyes that shut so tight that I talk to Jesus. Good job, everyone. Now, hands together, eyes closed. And let's talk to Jesus. Dear Heavenly Father, thank you that you look after us. Thank you that you keep us safe. Thank you that you love us and you protect us in all that we do. Please be with us, Lord. Help us to have a good Sabbath and a good week. And that we have wonderful times with our mummies and daddies and our brothers and sisters and anyone else we're with at this time. Thank you, Father, that all that you do for us in your name I pray. Amen. What a lovely prayer. Well done, everyone. Let's time to stand up. It's time to sing our next song. Now, I have a very important question. Does Jesus love us? You know that Jesus loves us? How do you know that Jesus loves us? Is it written somewhere? It is. I know where it's written. It's written in our Bibles. Because Jesus loves me. This I know for the Bible tells me so. Shall we sing Jesus loves me? Show me your hands. Are you ready to sing Jesus loves me? Let's do the actions together. Jesus that we know that Jesus loves us but do we love Jesus back because some of us might not love him that much but I know that in my heart I love Jesus more than anything do we ever tell Jesus that we love him probably not enough so why don't we tell Jesus let's sing 
I love Jesus. Does he know? Ready? I love Jesus. Does he know? Have I ever told him so? Jesus loves to hear me say that I love him every day. Yes, I love Jesus. Yes, I love Jesus. Yes. that we talk to Jesus and we tell him that we love him. So next time you talk to Jesus when you're praying, remember to tell him that you love him. We've now come to the time where we come and bring our pennies for Jesus. Have you got your pennies ready? I've got mine ready right here. Look! I've got my pennies ready and my penny pot. So I think it's time that you should go and get your pennies and your penny pot and we can do our offering together. Are you ready? Have you got your pennies? Then let's sing Hear the Pennies Dropping and come and bring your pennies for Jesus. Hear the pennies dropping. Have you put all your pennies in your penny pot? Well, I've put them all of mine in, so I think I should put the lid on mine. There we go. And let's sing a prayer over our offering. We're gonna sing, thank you for the world so sweet. So, hands together, eyes closed, and let's sing. Thank you for the world so sweet. Thank you for the food we eat. Thank you for good of you to come and bring your pennies for Jesus. Jesus is on his way to Jerusalem to celebrate the Passover feast. This was done by Jews every year to celebrate when God passed over the Israelites when they were held in slavery in Egypt. Jesus was riding into Jerusalem on a donkey and many people were following and celebrating as he travelled. The parade grew bigger and bigger as more people and children came to sing and celebrate Jesus coming to Jerusalem. There were children who were so happy to see Jesus, so they were dancing and waving the leaves of palm trees for him. Other people in the parade saw and started waving leaves too. Then some people started putting down their coats and shawls for Jesus to walk on. They called him King Jesus and they wanted to worship and celebrate their King. As Jesus and the parade got closer to Jerusalem, the Pharisees who lived in Jerusalem heard them and came out. They saw the people sing and dancing as Jesus rode on a donkey and they became angry at how the people were celebrating Jesus being King by waving the leaves and laying down their coats for him to walk on. They came to the parade and demanded they stop, but Jesus told them to leave the people in the parade alone, and if they tried to stop them, the stones and walls would sing his praises instead. As Jesus saw Jerusalem, he became so sad because he knew what was soon to come. Jesus started crying. He said to Jerusalem, I love you and your people forever, but your people do not love me. The people who were now cheering and calling him King Jesus would soon be the ones calling for his crucifixion. Jesus knew he was going to die soon because God and Jesus loved us all so much. Jesus sacrificed himself so that we may be saved from sin and then we can go live with him in heaven one day. Thank you Jesus for doing this for us.
We've now come to the time in our program where we say our memory verse together. Have you learnt your memory verse for this week? You have. Oh, you're so good. Well done. Why don't we say our memory verse together? Our memory verse this week is sing. Sing written in red. Two. Two written in orange. The. The written in yellow. Lord. Lord written in green. And our memory verse this week can be found in Psalm 98 verse 1. Psalm 98 verse 1 written in blue. Good job. You've learnt your memory verse this week. Why don't we say it together after three? One, two, three. Sing to the Lord. Psalm 98 verse 1. Let's say it again. Sing to the Lord. Psalm 98 verse 1. Congratulations, you've learnt your memory verse and we said it all together. Why don't we sing I'm glad I learnt my memory verse. Are you ready? I'm glad I learnt my memory verse. I'm glad I learnt my memory verse. I'm glad I learnt my memory verse on this bright Sabbath morning. Good job everyone, you learnt your memory verse together. Well done. Has anyone ever seen a thunderstorm? I have. They're really, really scary sometimes, aren't they? With all the thunder and the lightning and the rain. Did you know that one day Jesus got caught in a storm along with all the disciples and they were very, very afraid? And Jesus just said, storm be quiet. And the storm passed away. Now, sometimes it can feel like we're in a bit of a storm. And all we need to do is smile at the storm because Jesus will make everything better. We're going to sing a song about it. So I want you to copy all the actions from me as we sing with Jesus in the vessel. You can smile at the storm. Are you ready? With Jesus in the vessel, you can smile at the storm, smile at the storm, smile at the storm. With Jesus in the vessel, you can smile at the storm as we go sailing home, sailing, sailing home, sailing, sailing home. With Jesus in the vessel, you can smile at the storm. such a good job with the actions. I think we should do it one more time. Let's make that sailing really up and down like we're on the waves of a storm. Are you ready? With Jesus in the vessel, you can smile at the storm. Smile at the storm. Smile at the storm. With Jesus in the vessel, you can smile at the storm. As we go sailing home. Sailing. Everything is possible and nothing should scare us. I have a very big question. How big is God? Can you show me how big God is? Is he this big? Is he this big? This big? He's even bigger than this? How big is he? This big? Oh wow! Cause my God is so big. He's so strong and so mighty. There's nothing my God cannot do for you. That's amazing, isn't it? So I want you to make lots of space. Make big, big space. Cause we're gonna sing, my God is so big. Are you ready? My God is so big. So strong and so mighty, there's nothing my God cannot do for you. My God is so big, so strong and so mighty, there's nothing my God cannot do for you. The mountains are His, the rivers are His, the stars are His handiwork too. My God is so big, so strong and so mighty. There's nothing 
did so well. But do you think we can be even bigger? I know you can be really big. Can you be even bigger? Can you show me? Oh, wow, that's much better. Let's do this again. Are you ready? My God is so big, so strong and so mighty. There's nothing my God cannot do for you. My God is so big, so strong and so mighty. There's nothing my God cannot do for you. The mountains are his, the rivers are his, the stars are his handiwork too. My God is so big, so strong. God is so big, isn't he? And the things that he does for us, oh, they're just amazing. Wow, what a big God we have. We had so much fun today in Sabbath school, didn't we? We sang some songs, we had a great story, and we learned our memory verse. So I think what we should do is we should close our Sabbath school with a prayer. So hands together, eyes closed, and let's talk to Jesus and end our Sabbath school. Dear Heavenly Father, Thank you that we had so much fun in Sabbath school today, learning all about you and being able to be together even though we're apart. Thank you, Father, for all that you do and please continue to keep us safe and well until we meet again. In your name I pray, Amen. Our Sabbath school is over, let's sing, ready? Our Sabbath school is over and we are going to church. Goodbye. good to see you all and I hope that you continue to remain safe and I'll see you all next time. Bye bye. God bless. Bye bye.